Would you like fries with that? Yes! of this wrinkle. Robin, if you're trying to get out of Ben's staff meeting, it's going to take a little more than just a wrinkle. I got dibs of feeling nauseous. Alex, you were nauseous last time. Yeah, well, too bad. I called it. Do you think he'll buy an inner ear infection? I'm serious, you guys. This wrinkle wasn't here last night. I'm getting old. I'm sure it's not that bad, Robin. You're probably just exaggerating. Oh, my God. See? Did I always have this many eyelashes? Nice. Wretches. Why didn't I think of that? You don't think it's too much? No. Ben will let you out of the meeting for sure. There's a meeting? Tess, aren't you just using those crutches to get out of Ben's staff meeting? No. I, I just like the way they look. Can I try this for a sec? Okay, but make sure the white ends are at the top. Otherwise, they're really, really hard to get around on. Trust me. <laughs> yeah, thanks for the tip. <laughs> Oh, oh, my leg. Oh, Alex, what happened? Oh. <laughs> nice try, Alex. But you're not getting out of this meeting. <laughs> All right, listen up, people. Tomorrow will officially be my one-year anniversary as assistant manager here at Bulky's. Isn't that exciting, guys? <laughs> oh. Yes. Well, anyway... I had given myself one year to raise the staff's efficiency to a level I could be satisfied with. Well, unfortunately, I feel like I've fallen well short of my goal. <laughs> hey, knock it off! <laughs> now, in keeping with my point, I think I finally came up with a plan to give you all an incentive to buckle down. Hey, this better not involve group massages again. Because if it does, you could kill me out. <laughs> no, Alex. As you know, other restaurants would reward their hardest worker by naming a burger after them. For example, the Edna. Well, I thought of a better idea. Doing the same with condiments. Now I really feel nauseous. For instance, if a worker displays outstanding efficiency level, then that said worker would have the ketchup named after them. All the customers walking in here would substitute the ketchup's name for the employer's. Pardon me, do you have any pets? Eh? I'm sorry, I seem to have run out of Alex. Do you have any more? <laughs> what could be more fulfilling? I have a really bad toothache. <laughs> Robin, calm down. I'm telling you, your wrinkle is hardly noticeable. It's not that! It's the mouse! Oh, oh, the mouse! <laughs> no! Wait! I haven't finished my meeting! Ah! Stupid mouse! I thought I got rid of you. Well, <laughs> I'm gonna get rid of you once and for all. <laughs> There's got to be a pattern. Okay. This mouse was first seen at the cheese dispenser. Then, at the cheese cutting board, and finally, in the cheese section of the pantry. <laughs> oh, it's no use. I'll never figure out the pattern. Man, this mouse is a lot more intelligent than I originally thought. <laughs> That's it. There's only one way to capture it. I have to get inside this mouse's head. I'm wrinkled. Oh, Robin, it, it's a laugh line. It gives you character, moxie, wisdom. Really? Yeah. That and now you can get the seniors rated at the movies. <laughs> Flattery really isn't your strength.
strong suit, is it? No, not so much. <laughs> Vacuum cleaner busted again, Ben? <laughs> I'm not Ben. I'm a mouse. Ah. Always thought of you more as a weasel. I always thought of you more as a... Look, wise guy, for me to capture this mouse, I have to think like this mouse, I have to act like this mouse. In short, I have to be this mouse. <laughs> Small brain. Nosy. Causes girls to scream and run away. Yeah, I can see it. Yeah, laugh all you want, but mark my words. I'm going to catch this mouse before you know it. Yeah, well, be careful. You don't want to become someone's pet. Would you like some more Robin with your french fries? <laughs> hey, how about trying our new Robin traveling packets to take out? You can't be serious. What? You actually liked Ben's new incentive plan? Look, I'm getting old. I have to start thinking of how I'm going to leave my mark. Trust me, being named after relish is not the way to do it. <laughs> Aren't you worried that you'll wake up one morning and the whole world will have passed you by? That you'll look back at your life and it'll be nothing but a barrage of missed opportunities and unfulfilled dreams. And you feel that in all this, being named after a hamburger seasoning is going to remedy that. <laughs> Look, it's easy for you to be relaxed about your future. You probably have some sort of professional sporting career ahead of you. And what have I got? Nothing yet. Last night, my dad told me that when he was my age, he'd already risen to the top of his profession. What's your dad do? He's a paper boy. <laughs> Look, Robin, don't feel you have to jump on board some idiotic Ben scheme in order to make something of your life. Come on, Patty. Ben's not that bad. I mean, he's got some good ideas sometimes. <laughs> ah! oh! Oh! You're saying? Ben, are you okay? Uh, oh, oh, yes. Yes. I'm fine. <laughs> no, those rafters are really slippery. <laughs> No, being a mouse is harder than I thought. Nonsense, Ben. If anyone can do it, it's you. I don't know. I mean, I don't want to die before my one-year anniversary. Oh, come on. Don't be silly. Now you go on up there, back onto those shoddy ceiling rafters, and catch us a mouse. Go on. Really? I'm... Yeah. You're going to be okay. <laughs> <laughs> Tess, which do you think is most distinguishing? Being named after ketchup or being named after vinegar? <laughs> mm. Definitely vinegar. That vinegar it is. Your parents will be so proud. Hey, at least I'm not going to grow old as a nobody. <laughs> You're alive! I mean, hi, Ben. Hi. Look, I just thought it was way too dangerous to go back up on those rafters. Yeah, I knew it was too easy. But I did get just the thing to catch that pesky little mouse. It's an aromatic spray can that should stun the mouse. Right. I'm familiar with that stuff. I bet you are. Leave it. All you have to do is spray it around, and it will stun the mouse long enough to catch it. Exactly. <laughs> and then we can concentrate on even more important things, like condiment naming, huh? <laughs> well, you'll be happy to know I just dropped off that pesky little mouse at a pet shop. So now we can focus on which employee we are going to name the pickles after. <laughs> Hmm? Anyone? Come on, don't be shy. Who thinks they're deserving of the honor? Anyone? Okay, Tess, that kind of behavior just disqualified you. What about you, Patty? Huh? Pickles? Pickles? 
You know, I don't think that's very productive there, Missy. <laughs> Alex, how about you? <laughs> hey, Alex, what are you doing? <laughs> Knock it off! You're wasting valuable food! <laughs> oh, no. The spray. Didn't he just stun the mouse? It turned everybody really stupid. Uh. <laughs> Not again. I don't know how you do it. Sure! Well, well, what are you doing here? I was going to give you the bulky one-year service ribbon. There's a ribbon? And obviously, at this branch. Service is not on the menu. No, you used to say there was this mouse, right? And you have it's... a mouse? Yes. I mean, no, no, not anymore. I mean, the the mouse health is... department closes restaurants with mice. No, it's gone. It's gone. But now you see the spray. Oh, save it. If this restaurant isn't running smoothly when I come back, you won't see your one-year anniversary. Come on, snap out of it. <laughs> oh, this stinks. I got a restaurant to manage, and my staff is even too stunned to dry the cutlery. Dry the cutlery? I didn't mean for you to actually dry the cutlery. Dry the cutlery. <laughs> Hold on a second. Check the fries. Check the fries. <laughs> Sweep the floor. Sweep the floor. <laughs> That's Alex Patty. Come in here, please. Wipe the counter. Wipe the counter. Chop the lettuce. Chop the lettuce. Clean the sink. Clean the sink. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. They're completely under my spell. It only took me one year, but I finally figured out what it takes to get them to listen to me. Mouse spray. <laughs> Upper management. Here I come. Bulky burgers are delicious. Why not add two or three? Protein is good for you. Way to push the product there, Tess. Robin, how are those tablecloths coming? Look! Keep up the good work. And how's the stacking going in here, Patty? 36 down, 40 to go. Perfect. <laughs> Try our new Bulky's Deluxe. It's delicious and filling and won't give you reflux. Brilliant. I made it myself. And a splendid job you're doing, Alex. Keep up the good work. Very good, sir. Oh, uh, I am in heaven. You honestly expect me to believe there's been a drastic change in staff performance already? Yes, sir. A drastic change. For the better? Yes, sir. Yeah, all I did was suggest my incentive plan to them. I see. And I'm sure you're going to insist on telling me every little detail of this incentive plan? Yes, sir. Yes, I am. Oh, joy. Quite simply put, I just suggested we would change the garnishing name to reflect their own. Garnishing? Mm-hmm. Patty would be mustard, Tess would be ketchup, Robin would be vinegar, and Alex would be relish. I'm speechless. I knew you would be, sir. And now, now that it's working, I think it is time to implement my plan. Right. Well, if it really works... Thank you, sir. You will not regret this. Well, I just changed the condiment's name to reflect your own. Eat this. It's good for you. Uh, that's not how we serve the customers here, Tess, okay? Hey, my coat! 
What are you doing? Robin! I repeat, I do not want a bulky deluxe. But it's delicious and filling and won't give you reflux. He's trying to tell me what to eat. <laughs> Alex, we do not give customers orders. We take their orders. <laughs> hey, I was sitting on that. Okay, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I think we should all take a break for a few minutes, okay? But my customers need protein. Your customers are going to get protein later. That coat would look great oh, on no. table two. Oh, I have to tell that guy what oh. to order. Stack chairs! Stack chairs! Oh, stack no! Chairs. Please, stack everyone, chairs. Tell stop stack working! Stack <laughs> Hello, Ben. <laughs> Sir. I came to see for myself how your incentive plan is working. It's working out great. Perfect. Is that your cell phone ringing? I don't think so. Mind if I give the staff a few orders? No. I mean, no. I don't mind. All right. Patty, why don't you get me something to drink? Something to drink? <laughs> There you are, sir. Thank you, Patty. Thank you. Well, seems to be working so far. Mm. Alex, why don't you slice me some cheese? Right away, sir. <laughs> Thank you, Alex. There you are, sir. Thank you. Great. Well, that just about does it. I mean, you know, they're so tired from such an efficient day, and we don't want to overwork them now, do we? Of course not. <laughs> Good job, Ben. Thank you. Thank you, sir. <laughs> okay, Tess, in the freezer you go. With everyone else. Good girl. Okay, maybe the cold air will snap them out of it. The meat is all frozen. No. There are no more tables no. to cloth. I have no customers to order. No. Nothing to stop. Good. Tess, wipe the shelf. Wiping the shelf. Robin, organize the ice cubes. Organize the ice cubes. Alex, take inventory of the french fries. Taking inventory. Oh, buddy. Stack the juices. Stacking juices. <laughs> If you want them done lengthwise or up and down? Just do it! <laughs> right away, sir! <sighs> Excuse me, um, where's the ketchup? Right there, ma'am. It's the one that says, uh, Pess. And, uh, which is the mustard? Ah, mustard. Yes. Ha! You have it in your hands, Patty. <laughs> Why don't you just mark some ketchup and mustard? Well, ma'am, I'm trying a new incentive plan to get my employees to work more efficiently. Huh? Burgers for everyone. Yes! Patty! <laughs> That's Tess and Patty? Yes. I don't think your plan is working. <laughs> oh. Okay, you're coming with me, lady. <laughs> You too, Patty. Let go of the chair. Let go of the chair. Excuse me, Dust. Oh. My customers need beans. My chairs need stocking. I need you both to be in the freezer. Uh, obviously, you haven't been there long enough. The ice keeps organized. Oh, no. There's more tables to clutch. No. More customers to order. Oh. Ooh. Oh, what is that Whoa. smell? Oh, my eyes are watering. Oh. Someone light a match quick. Oh. It's coming from the food. Oh. 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 No, no, nobody leave. It's just... Oh. Oh. There you go. Oh. 
I was confused by the names on the bottle, so I, I blended the Tess, the Robin, and the Patty and the Alex together and created this horrible odour. Oh, no, no, wait. No. Oh. Oh. Alex, take this up to the garbage. Do it yourself. <laughs> what? Do it yourself. You're no longer taking my orders. That, that's fantastic. <laughs> Tess, uh. take these out to the garbage. Yuck. <laughs> Robin, Patty. No way. Uh. <laughs> you're cured, you're cured. It's the smell. <laughs> oh, sir. I assume you have a very creative explanation for all this. It was a mouse and I fell into it. <laughs> Ben, before you go, we got something for your one-year anniversary. Really? <sighs> Cooking lard. Yeah. Oh, you guys shouldn't have. We named it after you. Yeah, it's our way of saying we appreciate the way you manage the restaurant. Thanks, guys. I think. Hey, my wrinkle's gone. Must have something to do with that mouse spray. <laughs> yeah, that stuff's more effective than Botox. Wow, I'm not old anymore. I have my whole life ahead of me. Ben, can you spray some more of that mouse stuff? No way. Please. It'll help me stay younger looking, give me more time to make something of myself. Not on your life. Please? Mouse spray? Come on, Ben. Please? Mouse spray. Okay, guys, that's not funny, okay? Just go, go!